Hey guys, it's Ivan from Indoor Ivan. I hope you are doing well and thank you for coming back to my channel. Uh, in this video, uh, we are doing some curbside pickup uh, for some plants. Uh, as you know, a lot of garden centers right now are closed off to the public. Um, so your best bet for getting plants is either curbside pickup or delivery. Uh, there are some garden centers uh, that are open to the public, um, but a lot of those have agricultural uh, ties with them. Uh, so let's get started uh, on our ordering uh, and then we'll go through the picking up process and see how things go. So for my first curbside pickup, uh, I have decided to use Terra uh, just because they have a lot of plants that are on sale and they have a pretty easy to use uh, website. Um, you can browse through the plants that they have on sale uh, and then some of the plants that they have in stock. Uh, the selection is a little bit smaller uh, than some of the other greenhouses where you have to call in, but I do really like the convenience. Uh, for today, we're going to be ordering uh, some primulas, so we're going to go under annual color. Uh, so as you can see, um, more plants that uh, are on sale and then some plants uh, that they have in stock as well. Um, so lots to choose from. Uh, so. We'll click on our Primula pack. So for $10, for 10 uh, Primulas, you can't go wrong. Um, so we are going to add that to our cart. So viewing our cart, uh, we have our order right there, and we're not doing delivery, we're going to do store pickup. Uh, so I'm going to click on the store of my choosing. I like Waterdown just because it's close and that's where I worked. So I'm going to select my date, uh, which is Monday, and my time for 3 p.m. So after that, I am going to click on the checkout. So after pressing the checkout, you'll enter your contact information and your address, uh, and then you'll continue on um, with the payment process. When I went through this, uh, I got to the step where I was adding my gift card. Uh, and unfortunately, I did run into some problems uh, with the physical gift card. So little did I realize that the physical gift cards don't work uh, on the website. So I did have to call in uh, to the Terra stores. Uh, I called Waterdown and Hamilton. Unfortunately, when I by the time I called, uh, they already ran out. Uh, luckily, the Burlington location did have them in stock, so I placed an order uh, through them. So because Terra doesn't do uh, plant pickups during the weekend, I did have to wait until a weekday uh, to do that. So coming into the Terra parking lot, uh, it was sectioned off quite nicely uh, where you kind of knew where you were supposed to park because you couldn't park in any of the places where there were crates or shopping carts. Uh, so what you need to do is you pull in, uh, so I chose spot 30. From there, you would call uh, the store, let them know which parking spot you have and then your order, uh, and then they'll come out uh, to give you your plants. So from there, uh, after the plants were put into the trunk, I decided just to drive home, uh, just to avoid any extra contact. Uh, so on the drive home, and before I opened up the trunk, there were a few things that I was uh, curious about. The quality of the plants, whether or not, you know, those plants were in bloom, uh, or were they almost, you know, kind of done flowering at that point. And then also if the plants were still standing up in their pots. Uh, I've seen uh, some horror pictures uh, and videos of plant pickups where everything's kind of toppled over and plants are out of uh, their pot. So that for me um, was something that I really wanted to see. I wanted to know whether or not my plants would still be standing up after my 20 minute drive home. So opening up the trunk, I was happy to see that all of my primulas were still standing up. Uh, they looked vibrant, uh, which was great. Uh, so I eventually planted those into the garden. Uh, so after that, I got those plants uh, out of the car and spent the afternoon uh, planting those out uh, in the front of our garden, just to add a little bit more uh, color. Thank you. 
Anyways, that's it for this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Uh, until next time, bye.